The American Red Cross is facing a nationwide shortage of blood donations. Our Chase Campbell has the details. The American Red Cross depends on blood donations to respond to disasters and accidents and to save lives. But right now, they're facing a problem. Through May and June, we started experiencing nationwide a significant drop off in blood donations. It's something that we actually experience every year, but this year was truly significant. Sharon Kesselring, executive director of the Ohio River Valley Red Cross, says this drop off could be attributable to people just wanting to get out and enjoy the summer. This year in particular, people are very anxious to have a lot of fun activities, go on vacation, a lot of family gatherings, things like that. And unfortunately, that takes away any kind of focus on some of those really important things in life, including the fact we need an adequate blood supply on the shelf at all times, ready when a, an individual actually needs the blood. Regardless of why people aren't donating, Kesselring says it's a big problem for people who need blood for any reason. There is no substitute for human blood. You can't just pull it out of thin air when somebody's laying in a hospital needing blood. Due to the shortage of donations, Kesselring says it's more important than ever for people to donate if they can. Any type of blood, we need to make sure we have it available. It's going to go a long way to helping us start to buck up those uh, reserves again and making sure that we have an adequate supply. Kesselring says that thanks to the Red Cross Blood Donation app, it's easy to see where you can donate nearby and sign up to give. The Red Cross will be hosting a blood drive on July 3rd at Fairlawn Baptist Church in Parkersburg. And Kesselring says they still have a lot of slots available. In Parkersburg, West Virginia, Chase Campbell, WTAP News.